These are the Sears duckbill pliers. Notice that I've rounded off the tips. And you want to buy a pair that when you let go with the handle, it opens by itself and you don't have to push it. But they're one of the most important tools in my arsenal. One of the best uses of these duckbill pliers is that you can turn the screw without using a screwdriver. And it's very easy just to feel underneath for that screw without looking. When you're twisting the wire in the block, you need to make sure and lift the damper under lever up and press really firmly against the upstop rail. And then you can twist the wire in the block. You're holding it up and you're twisting that wire on top of the block. But you've got to make sure you push that up or you could break the pinning. Okay. If the damper is rising late, you can see that the damper block is higher than the other ones. I don't need to loosen the screw. All I need to do is take my duckbill pliers and pry that down like that. See it's right on and it just took that uh, second or two to do.